Yeah. Life without you been feeling kind of strange. Well, I see that you're doing very well. Ha, you looking very well. I miss the way your perfume smell. I miss the way that you blow up my line just to make sure that I'm feeling well. Welcome back to my channel. I am Keisha Jabri, and today I am here with Zay Money, my boyfriend. And we're about to play a little game called Let's Get Deep. You can find this game at Target. You can also buy it online. So it's three different categories. It's icebreaker, deep, and deeper. How we're gonna do it? We're gonna get eight cards out of each category. You gonna do four, I'm gonna do four. He gonna ask me four, and I'm asking him four. Right, and I guess we'll go in order from levels. Icebreaker, yep. deep, then deeper. And we're gonna yep. get to deeper at the end, so y'all better wait and see. Sure, sure. But before we hop into it, y'all already know what y'all have to do. Y'all have to go ahead and thumbs up this video and also comment down below and tell me what you guys want to see next. And also subscribe to my channel because my cash baby's lit. I'm lit and if you subscribe, then you can be lit too. And that's all what? Oh, period. So yeah, let's Major just key. hop right into this video. Okay, who wanna, you want to rock, paper, scissors to yeah, go first? Rock, paper, scissors. Okay. One, two, three. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Too predictable. <laughs> Oh, we got we. Oh, I what thought I it? had lost. No, this is this is take one to take off. Okay. Mm, 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 Probably comedy for sure, but if it's if this we you know with a female, you know, gotta do a thriller just so she can get scared. You are. That's so lame and weak. Who even does that? Who You gotta plan that. You gotta, but if I'm by myself, I don't know. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. 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 Let's you still clean it off you. I think you clean it off you. Because, I mean, if we're going to apply that to the shower, we got to apply that to everything. Like, the, the towel, dishes, the how we wash stuff. You got to apply that to everything. If you feel like you sending your dirt, then can't nothing really get clean for real. Pancakes or waffles? Pancakes. Waffles are very serious. Belgian waffles be... As far as traveling, flying or driving? Ooh, it's a vibe for both. But if I had to choose, if I had to choose, I would say flying just because it's the shortest amount of time most of the time. And I got back problems. But sometimes driving be cool because you save a lot of money and you get to like be in a car and talk mm -hmm. the whole time. For sure. You take a bathroom break. Oh, you can take a bathroom break. I'm not playing. I have to. Never flown. Never. Netflix or Hulu? Hulu. 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 Rick and Morty's on Hulu. Rick and Morty. Rick. For sure. Rick. Rick. Best show alive. Good question for you. New York or Los Angeles? New York. All day long. LA. Boo. <laughs> zero out of ten. Would not recommend to nobody. I didn't enjoy myself at all. I ain't been to LA. I know that's a ten out of ten. <laughs> Vodka or tequila? I'm a Casamigos, man. Casamigos! Vodka? If you drink vodka, you're dangerous. That's... That's distilled, what is it? Rubbing alcohol. No, nah, you're not supposed to drink distilled that. Distilled rubbing alcohol. Nah, that's what it tastes like to me. Oh. You prefer calling or texting? Calling. I'm one of those. I'm, I'm the person that everybody talks about that asks you what you're doing and then I face on you. I just do that. I can't help it. It's just a part of me. I don't know. I like calling people. I answer it. Coffee or tea? <laughs> I don't drink either of those. <laughs> he don't like, he hates tea, but sweet they tea is so good. Hmm? Why well, I'm sick, sick. They say what? Coffee's natural, girl. Oh, you believe that? Yeah. I'm with you. Okay, so now we're gonna move on to the next round, which is deep. So I'm ready to see these questions. You ready? No. I ain't got no choice. Who oh, wait, who? Time? I went first last oh, time, so it. you gotta leave me. I hope you don't get too deep. Do you prefer home cooked meals or restaurant food? I prefer. I prefer restaurant food. I'm sure of it. 
You just got a better chance of having some good restaurant food. I mean, the person on the cook, you can have good home food every time. Yeah, but you can't just eat at everybody's home. You you bound to eat a good meal at whatever restaurant you go to. Let's see where you're going with that. What was your favorite meal growing up? Why? Favorite meal growing up? Um, my mother makes a uh, hash brown baked casserole. 10 out of 10. <laughs> 10 out of 10 stuff there. I can't. That's, Wait, it's a what? It's a hash brown baked casserole. So it got like um hash brown shit, like mm -hmm. hash brown. You got cheese. Where's the in casserole it. part though? Casserole and it's like the dish set up. That means it's in a dish you put in the oven. Really, it's just ham, cheese, and some hash brown pieces. And she throws some breadcrumbs on the top. So that's basically, it's just hash browns and cheese. And ham. Oh, and it's ham. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get you to eat it. You'll see what the hype. It's my turn. <laughs> do you believe opposites attract, or do you prefer being with someone who is similar to you? That's a good question. I think I get along with people who are not like myself. I think I just get along with people better when we're not trying to be the same person. It on some bosses can't all sit together or <laughs> no it's not even like that it's just i don't know it's just it always clash i hate it's females for, you, for sure <clears throat> if you could only eat one type of cheese for the rest of your life what kind would it be why oh that's a good one it's either cheddar or mozzarella and it's like which one do i eat the most so like i can't eat pasta period you gotta eat cheddar pasta Mozzarella. I thought with macaroni and cheese or cheese eggs, but it's Alfredo. Put some mozzarella eggs? No, I just won't have to eat eggs no more. Alfredo for breakfast. Who turned is it? Would you rather be the most famous person or the richest one? Richest? And why? Because, I mean, famous is cool until it's not. Like, if you, you know if you know, but if you don't, you don't. It's just... It has its pros and cons. What's the cons of being rich? <laughs> What's the cons of being rich? It ain't nothing, like. And all that. It's a lot of cons to being famous, but it's not a lot. It's not any for me. Well, I guess it could be, but for the most part, I would rather be rich than famous for me. What does your typical Sunday look like? And tell the truth. Typical Sunday, I get up late because I only sleep in Saturday, Sunday. I get up early morning. I try to go to the gym. Gym always open one to seven. Um, <laughs> yesterday was Sunday. What did we do? Oh, might might turn up. You know, it's a Sunday. Sunday's still the weekend. Go turn up still. Might go hit that place or this place. Have me a little fun. But yeah, come live with you at night. <laughs> Typical Sunday. Get ready for Monday. You be even smoke ten times. Mm, no. <laughs> By the end of that Sunday. No, we don't do none of that on Sunday. So save your day. Let's see what we got for you. Uh okay, so. Would you rather be a character in an action movie or a comedy? Action. I don't like comedies. I don't like comedy movies. They're they're just never funny to me. Like they're just never funny enough. It always just feel like it's just trying so hard. I don't like comedy. What's something you get competitive over? Um, telling my siblings happy birthday first. We gotta. Big, all my family understands, like, whoever first is first, and we all fight for that. And we also fight to see who ain't go first on the phone. All right, it's time to move on to deeper. You ready? Mm-mm. Ah, it's my turn to pull first. Oh, my goodness. People don't need to know about your life. <sighs> okay, you ready? We gonna do 10 of these since the video is kind of short. We gonna extend it. We gonna do 10 of these. Five and five. 
I guess it's a little more. We'll see. I didn't know where you were going with that. <laughs> we'll see. We'll You're see. We'll see. Man. <laughs> I'm not good at math. Oh, that's not even. Anyways, in what way are we the most different? I know how to put this. We're most different. How we respond to the outside world. You're a little safer, you know, you don't like to go here, you don't like to go there because you feel like it's not safe. I'm gonna go here, I'm gonna go there and there. I don't know, I'm pretty more outgoing and social, you know, I go to a party. I'm not stuff going. Stuff like that, but it's just not, I'm not real uncomfortable. I'm what was the first thing you bought with your own money? First thing I bought with my own money was... I'm gonna upgrade like the first, first thing purchase. and then first big purchase. First thing I bought with my money was probably closer shoes at the time because I didn't really have nothing else to buy back then. And my nice. first big purchase was my car. My car that I have now. That was my first big purchase. I'm sure. <laughs> okay, what's the story of the first time you got drunk? <laughs> <laughs> that was a great night. If you're featured in this story, man, you was part of a night. It was graduation night. We, we just graduated high school, you know. What happened? I went to this first little party. It was turn, you know. Saw him, him, him who graduated. All the brothers. Got shut down. So then we went to some hotels. Me and a couple other friends. And I didn't, I didn't understand liquor at the time. I, had, I thought you had to drink like a whole bunch to get drunk, like a whole bunch. So I got a little 7-Eleven cup, about this big, <laughs> filled up about this much in hand in it. We had some Hennessy, drunk the whole thing. And it literally felt like, like I was in a slow motion movie. And all I did was go to sleep. We went to McDonald's, <laughs> I ordered something, but then, Fell asleep with my drink in my hand, spilled it everywhere. I saw you that night. Mm -hmm. I know you saw a different man that night too. It was just, it was a very crazy, fun experience. Graduation Always night. wait till you're graduated to do stuff like that. Wait till you're legal to do that. Yeah, that's what I meant. Same thing. What did it say? <laughs> what did you used to do with all your free time before we started dating? What did I used to do with all of my free time before we started dating? Well, to be very truthful, I was in another relationship, but I really didn't put all my free time into that relationship, I would say. More so, my free time was going like YouTube. I was recording videos back then, like that's it. That's all I really had to care about. Doesn't belong to the streets. What's an aspect of yourself you've seen improve since dating me? I'd probably say being, um, I was very wild and careless before. You definitely made me, you know, clean up my image and stuff like that. You know, be more serious, take everything more serious. You know, as far as, you know, friends, all that type of maturing stuff, being with a woman really does to you. Really good. A good one. Oh yeah, good one. No. That's about it. That's it. It's a good big important piece. What is the biggest deal breaker in the significant other? The biggest deal breaker with the significant other is oh bad hygiene. That's a deal breaker. That's a deal breaker. I don't understand. Like if we was talking and everything, and I finally. Went to your house and it was nasty, like, I wouldn't be able to, I couldn't even look at you the same if I'm being honest. That's like a deal breaker. I can't, I can't do it. I teach them that. No, I'm not teaching. You can't teach, no. I know no, we too old to be talking about teaching somebody how to, no. No. That don't sound good. What is something that you've always wanted to do but never had the guts to? Skydiving. You want to skydive? Like, yeah. fake skydive? Or I really skydive? want to skydive, like, from a plane, but... I can't do it. No. I can't do it. That's why I haven't flown yet either. Like I'm not. I'm not even rocking with planes. Honestly. Watch too much Netflix. Too much stuff. You see Manifest. 
just fuck around. Boy, ain't nothing in manifesting not gonna happen for real in real life. No, no. Skydiving for sure. That looks fun, and that's a thrill. Oof. I'm not gonna be the one who parachute. Don't open one. If you knew you were going to die tomorrow, what would you do on your last day? Cry. I would cry the whole time. No. No. Yes, I would. New approach. New approach. What would you do if you got the last 24 hours? Give me from when you wake up to when you go to sleep. If you go to sleep, I personally wouldn't. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Starting at 8 a.m. What's happening? 8 a.m. I would wake up and ball my eyes out this <laughs> the entire the whole day, the whole day until it's time. Okay. And then I'm gonna get scared as. Hell part is, <laughs> I know you're dead ass. Whole day spent crying. I'm gonna be like, we can't even go have no fun, Keisha. Come on, you got you six hours left. Talking, you're not even gonna see you have a little I can't do it all. You think I wanna spend my last six hours like this? Yeah, you can see it. You think I wanna right? spend my next 24 hours dead? <laughs> no! When was the last time you cried? Yeah, my sister was in the hospital. She's well now though. I'm they right. said when She's, was the last one? Um, that was about what? Two weeks ago? A week ago. And I was just sad because, you know, I don't see my siblings going through no pain, man. My siblings, man. I feel the pain too. So I had to shed a little tear with beard rope. Hate to throw you into the equation. <laughs> no, you just can't have it to where you was crying by <laughs> Oh, that's even worse. You crying in a big group? What? Yeah, we some group family cries. Nah, but I'm not crying in nobody's group. Okay, okay. <laughs> When's the last time you cried? We want to go by the hour or the day. <laughs> when was the last time I cried? That day on the porch? Or was you in Why? here? You didn't tell me. Do you remember? Oh. My anxiety attacks you making me cry. Dang. What was that, like a week ago? Yeah. Okay, so we went through the deck and we got some spicy cards. So we finna pluck some and see what we get. You ready? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I, I I think I'm going first, right? Oh, no, that's, that's a setup <laughs> for sure. <laughs> Didn't I just answer one? No! I just answered the last one. <laughs> no, come on, because remember, oh. I did icebreaker, you did deep, and it's my... <laughs> Hey, it is my turn! Right Started that one, now we on the, Come on. It's okay, go ahead. What's your least favorite sex position? <laughs> the one where... <laughs> <laughs> Which one? Where you, when you turn around, but you on top. Oh, you don't you turn around. <laughs> That don't connect how it's supposed to connect. You don't like it? I don't know if it's just a... Who you did that with? What the f***? Okay, Casey. What? If you could only do one sex position for the rest of your life, which would it be? It ain't no plea to fist. If I could only do one for the rest of my life? Yeah. Missionary. Why? They did not ask why. They didn't say why now, come on. When were you last in a fight? What caused it and why? I haven't fought since middle school. So tell us about it. Jordan Hall, if you still exist, boy, he brought my perfect attendance streak. You Six. got suspended? Yeah. Sixth grade. Ooh, slap boxing. I smacked that boy too hard in the bathroom. Everybody said, ooh, ooh. So he wanted to fight now and then first, Staff came in there and broke it up anyway. We tried to tell him we were slap boxing. Didn't care. Spending <laughs> me for five days. Broke my kindergarten through sixth grade. Perfect attendance streak. Maybe that's why I ain't fought since. You were supposed to be a bigger person. I was. That's why I, everybody said, ooh, when I smacked him. No, I mean, you're supposed to walk away after he got mad and say, bro, come on, we were just supposed to be playing. You ain't been smacked in the bathroom, <laughs> slap boxing. No, I have That's not. That's a different pride. I hate you, boy. Oh, it's your turn. Okay, 
What's your favorite memory of us together? My favorite memory of us together. When I used to pull up on him, not no specific time, but when I used to pull up on him when we just used to sit in the car and talk. Those were some epic times. That's my favorite times. <clears throat> when was the first time you realized you wanted to be in a relationship with me? Um, when I did you. In ninth, ninth grade. Ninth grade? Yeah. You wanted to be with me. I said, what I asked you, do you have a man? You said, yeah. I said, I'll be back. And then a year went by, oh, new man. Okay. Told her I'll still be back. <laughs> then she came back for me. And yeah, I already knew when you came in the foot like that day, what was going on. You didn't know nothing. Where's one place you want to have sex where we have it yet? Stop. Um, one place that we haven't. Far away. Oh, yeah. Boom. <clears throat> on a beach. On a beach, for sure. Not in America. Yeah. Bucket list. Got to on a beach. Have you ever done drugs? <laughs> Which one? <laughs> huh? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Waukesha. Waukesha? Oh, I didn't say that. Oh. Um. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm saying that one. Mm -hmm. That's it. Waukesha. Darkest set, Mercus set, Perkus set. Some Darkest set, Mercus set. Okay, it's um. It's some weed and yeah. some alcohol and yeah. some wakisha. Yeah. You no, know, I done some shrooms with the homies too. I done some shrooms. Hope I'm not getting all junky. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that ain't nothing hard. Niggas is in school. <laughs> oh yeah, that's about it. You gonna sum it up there? You gonna sum it up there? Yeah. Okay, your turn. Yeah. We got, yeah. after this card, we got one more card to go. What is the scariest memory? Like ever, like scariest, scariest mem memory. Scariest you've ever been. I don't know. The stuff I be scared about the most, I make up in my head. She's not lying. <laughs> like the scariest, the, the craziest shit that I go through is in my head. Never happened before, it's just up here. <clears throat> this is the last question of the game. What's the sexiest thing about me? Definitely like everything. You gotta Ooh, give one We got thing. one thing. Okay, the old thing. Okay. So we're not gonna include the lips. So we ain't gonna No include. lips. Let's see. We just had. To. I would say your personality. That's so cliche no, now. The no, sexiest but, thing though. But, but I mean it. Like you said, like your favorite memory of us was in the car. Like. That was luck. Back when all we did was just talk in the car and all that. It was just everything. It made me, that's what made me fall in love and all that type of stuff. I, I had Sexiest to. thing about me is my personality. Personality that includes laugh, how you laugh, how you talk, the way you think, you know, drive, ambition. You're a hardworking woman. That's part of your personality. Yeah. Thanks. Definitely. Thanks. Definitely. And then you got all the other about the people. <laughs> that's the end of this video i really hope you guys enjoyed it if you did please do not forget to thumbs up this video and also comment down below and tell me what you guys want to see next and also go ahead and subscribe to zay money tv's channel i'm gonna have it listed in the top right corner and also do not forget to subscribe to my channel because of my cash baby blitz i'm letting it be you subscribe but you can blitz too and that's on what so yeah i'm gonna see y'all in the next video for sure peace